New this morning, hundreds of Oregon students paid tribute to a civil rights icon. We were there as students at a North Portland elementary school walked to school in honor of Ruby Bridges. Fox's Mia Villanueva joins us in studio with more on how they're commemorating this important day in history. Good morning, Mia. Kim, good morning. Yeah, on this day 64 years ago, six-year-old Ruby Bridges made history by becoming the first black student to integrate a formerly whites-only school in Louisiana. Today, decades later, the impact she's made is not lost on students, especially students at Boise Elliott Elementary School, who walked to school in her honor. If it wasn't for Ruby Bridges, I, like, I know a bunch of my friends, we wouldn't, there would be certain schools that we wouldn't be able to go to. It's really important to honor her because she changed American history. Since 2018, students across the country have been celebrating Ruby Bridges Day by walking to school. On November 14th, 1960, Bridges became one of the first students to integrate William France Elementary School in New Orleans, Louisiana. Today, her contributions to the civil rights movement are still being honored right here in Portland. What we're doing in Portland Public Schools is important. What's happening on this walk and, and the commemorating Ruby Bridges' walk to school is important and that we're going to continue to do important work every day. Portland Public School Superintendent Dr. Kimberly Armstrong, along with students, staff, and family, families all walk to Boise Elliott Elementary School in Ruby Bridges honor. We believe in the work that's ahead of us and we're all leaning in to what we need to do to make experiences and outcomes different for students. Students we spoke with even acknowledging that outcomes in education could have looked much different for black students if it wasn't for the courage of Ruby Bridges. Black people or any certain people shouldn't be scared to go to school. They don't need to think that they're being set up to fail. The students were so knowledgeable about the history it. of today. Yeah. It was so great, so refreshing. They were very appreciative and really acknowledge, acknowledging like, hey, we might not even be at this school altogether mm, if it yeah. wasn't for Ruby Bridges. Wow. It's so important kids learn this. I will, I'd like to share a quick anecdote because this is something I'll always remember as a dad. I, my, my daughter was, my daughter Josie, I think might have been in first grade and we went to the library and I said, you can check out a book on anything you want. She said, I'd like to check out a book about Rosa Parks. Aww. And it was because she learned about her in school and, yeah. and was fascinated by it and wanted to learn that more. So so, great. so these lessons really, I've seen firsthand, they really resonate with kids. Well, and they'll so, stay yes. with them. Exactly, right? exactly, so, into adulthood. So, yeah, mm -hmm. so important. And by the way, if you want your kiddo at home to learn more about Ruby Bridges, PPS has great resources to teach students about her. So we have a link to those resources on our website, kptv.com. So good. Awesome yeah. story, Mia. Thank, Thank you. you very much.